All right, people, we're in a situation here that says we're looking at a hot water tank. I'm going to show you what we got here. These are the elements. I want you to see how corroded they are and burned out. Okay. They're 4,500 watt uh, uh, elements. This is the lower one. Could barely get it out. That's the upper one. Look how corroded that is. I want to show you something here. This is the situation. See how packed full that is of sediment? That's about six inches taller than your drain. And I knew I had an issue here. When I uh, went to drain it, it took forever for the water to come out. It should only take about 20 minutes, if that. And this took over well over an hour. To What's happening is the water had to seep through all this element to get drained. Now, a lot of people say they drain them every year, but they don't do it. And with this situation, you want to make sure you do it once a year. And every five years, you want to change your elements because you run into this. And what happens is some elements laying in all that sediment, what they do is they try to... Uh, it's trying to heat the water through that cement, if you will. And what that does is it makes it very inefficient and your price and your uh, your heating element is uh, constantly running on the electricity and causing problems. So if you don't do this currently, get someone to drain your hot water tank and get the sediment out of the bottom, especially if you're on a well system. But uh, that's the deal, people. The upper one wasn't as bad, but it still was corroded. But that lower one, if you can see how much higher that sediment is than the drain, this is the problem. When you do have these type of situations, I know life takes over, but you got to take the time to say, we're going to spend it just like a birthday. We're going to take it once a year and drain this out. And what it does is it rinses the sediment out rather than trying to go through this situation. All right, this is Bri. I'm at somebody else's compound. I will keep you updated. I've got to get on down the road.